That's what it do, y'all. That's what it do, Shard Timers. Hello, 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 hello. Y'all ever watch Three Stooges? Have you ever heard of Three Stooges? Either your mama watched it or you watched it. Your grandma on them watched it or you just don't even have a clue. I don't know. I didn't get on here for that, for that, for that. Guess what, y'all? This is a really serious, serious message, a inspirational message. And I really got a cool little system set up here. I got my webcam over here. And over here, I got my lyrics. And we are listening to a song. Not listening to a song because I really don't even know how the song goes. This is... I think this is really powerful because I'm sharing the lyrics with you. Maybe you know the song, whether you do or not, it's still going to be a message that I pray and hope that you can relate to and resonate with. So the name of the song is Praying. That's just the name of it right there, Praying. Never heard of it till today. A YouTuber told me about it. I pushed pause over there watching her and came over here to my phone and put in this lady praying uh her name is kesha it looks like keisha without the i but it's kesha what an awesome name right it's a beautiful song she won the um she performed live at the at the grammy awards but this was back in 2018 uh so this song and, uh, and everything is like six years old here we go let's get into it okay the lyrics are powerful. I do not know the story behind it, but somebody hurt this lady. I don't know if it was her mother, but I have to just get on here and and, 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 and spit it out to you right now because of the power of it behind it, because of the lyrics, because of the pain you feel. Look her up on YouTube and look at her video. Look at, she got several videos. Just click on play on one of them. You'll feel that power of that song. So, the song starts off like this. It says, well, you almost had me fooled. You told me I was nothing without you. Oh, but after everything you've done, I can thank you for how strong I have become. Hoo -hoo. Hoo. I don't know about y'all, but that hits home for me. I could say that to quite a few people. Who has hurt you in your life and tried to literally damn near kill you with their words, with their evil eye, with their actions, with their non-helping ass, I want to say hands, but they didn't even give you a hand. See, that's the point right there. They didn't give you a hand. They didn't give you a hand out or a hand up. They wanted to see you literally die. They wanted to see you fail, right? That is bar number one. Bar two, the next one says, because you brought the flames and you put me through hell. I had to learn how to fight for myself. And we both know all the truth I could tell. I'll just say this. I wish you farewell. Ooh. God, if that ain't powerful, this girl right here, if the Holy Spirit ain't in her, I just got to say that, that that's powerful, y'all. They brought the flames. They, they brought the flames. They brought the fire. They brought the heat. When they wanted to stab you, or they did stab you. When they talked about you and you turned the other cheek. When they got you right in your face and head up, squared up with you. <laughs> when you was just trying to be you and they diminished you. I always wanted to know what diminished me on the piano, but now I know what diminished me. It mean back up, the less than. It mean far out, far away, like back. It just means back. They wish you could get back. They wish you would get back. 
go back somewhere where you came from because you ain't from here. And see, that's it right there. They know you ain't from here. Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Let's go on to number three real quick. It says, I hope you're somewhere praying. Praying. And I hope your soul is changing. Changing. It says, uh, I hope you find your peace falling on your knees praying. This is not, this is turning the other cheek to the people or the person who hurt you so much, who damaged you, who, ooh, who messed you up. You know what I want to say. Who messed you up for your whole, for your whole life. And if it came in a different way, if it came by one person, two persons, or a whole group of people that was against you, that dogged you out. You was the black sheep of the family, y'all. I know this. I'm telling you what you already know. Okay, you was the black sheep. Yes, you was. Dogged you out through the ringer, through the mud. But guess what? You're not hating back. You never tried to get vengeance. You don't even like to fight. You don't even like all that violence that was around you. All right? So what you're doing is hoping, you're praying for these people. You're praying for your enemies because they're truly your enemies. You thought they was your family. You thought they was your lovers, your friends, your wife. You thought that was your husband. And it was on paper, but not in the heart. They don't have your best, they did not have your best interest at heart. God has tried to pull you away from these people. Even after you got grown, God was giving you signs like you knew there was something intuitively. Come on now, ain't something, you know who it is and what it was, your spirit. The spirit of God resonating within your spirit, within your spirit saying like, your, 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 your gut feeling, your intuitive brain down in your, um, in your core, in the core, the center of you. You know what that was, telling you to get up out of there. But we stayed. We stayed. We stayed. Because nobody instilled love in us, for number one. Nobody instilled self-worth in us. You ain't have no. Where you going? Where you going? How, how the hell was you supposed to muster up some self-worth when you ain't had none? You haven't had it. Where are you supposed to find it if you didn't even know you had to look for it? It's your time. It's your time, Shar Thomas. It's your time to shine. To show the world who you are because you're proving it to yourself. And the people that's waiting on you who don't even know that they need some self-worth. That's who we do it for, right? Yeah, they didn't want this message to come out. They didn't want it to come out. It's okay. Let's do one more. I'm proud of who I am. Can you say that with me now, Shar, Star, Shar Thomas? Please, say it with me. I'm proud of who I am. How did that feel? <sighs> Feels good. I'm proud of who I am. No more monsters. I can breathe again. They were vultures. They were monsters. They were always attacking you. You said, what's wrong with me? Why they do that? You felt like you had to defend yourself and fight all the time. Chaos. You was always surrounded by chaos, fighting, bickering, going back and forth. If that's you, put that in the comments. Back, back, forth and forth. Didn't seem like you was ever going to get out of that. It, it seemed like you was destined to die like that. Like that's, that was you. That was all you knew. That was your life. You didn't even think you needed to get out of that. You ain't even think you needed to get out of that situation. The devil is a liar and the father of them. 
Let me give you the rest here so I can get off of here, y'all. No more monsters. They acted like vultures. They acted like monsters. They were monsters. They were demons. I am very bold. Like a lion. Courageous. I know what it was. They were demonic. They had entities on them. Attached to them. That would always pick fights with you. To hurt you. To stab you. To wound you. And twist it. You feel me? They'd stab you and twist it. It wasn't good enough just to leave well enough alone. They couldn't leave well enough alone when you was over there crying. They had to kick you. Kick you some more. And you know what? It becomes a repetitive cycle. And you find that person in another face. You find that same narcissistic people in another face. You find that same gas lamp lighting sucker. In, in another person, in another face, because that entity has been after you all your life. Okay? Wake up, people. Wake up, my people. Wake up. Get thee behind me, Satan. You gots to bounce, y'all. You gots to go. Get that power, get that strength, and get the... There's help available. Get up out that situation, okay? Come on. Um... So they were monsters. And now you can breathe again because you done got free or you about to get free because of this message. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Email me. Email me if you need some help. If you need some resources, I'm your resource girl. I'm your go-to resource girl, okay? Bet. Now, we almost done. Okay, I'm proud of who I am. No more monsters. I can breathe again. And you said that I was done. You said that I was done. Oh, she's done. She's wrapped up. Oh, he ain't shit. He he is a loser. Oh man, he gon' he gon' die on the streets. He gon' he gonna be homeless. He ain't gonna never have nobody to love love them and et cetera, et cetera. Fill in the blank. Write it in the comment section. What they told you. That's not true. It's an illusion. It's a story in their head, not yours. What's your story? You rewrite your story the way you see it, the way you want it. You have the right to co-create with your creator and be whatever. You could have whatever you like. You could be there with whatever you like, whatever you want, okay? I can't even finish because I'm fired up. I'm preaching and I know it is. And it needs to come out. Because... Whoever said life was a game, Florence Chauvel, I don't know what she meant. I don't know what she meant by that. But it's what you make it. You can make your you can make your heaven and you can make your hell. People don't put that on you, even though they projected stuff on you. You don't have to accept it anymore. You don't have to keep it. You take your power back. That's what I'm learning to do. You stand up. Stand up for your rights. I don't know that song. Okay. Um, you said you said I was done. They thought you was washed up. They thought you was done. It says, well, you were wrong. And now the best is yet to come. The best. Come on, y'all. Hey. The best is yet to come. The best. <laughs> the best is yet to come the best is yet to come i'm telling you omg man i wrote a song called dream big let me finish this and then we'll get to that okay the best is yet to come because i could make it on my own and i don't need you i found a strength that i've never known i found a strength that i've never known you short timers have potential Locked up, trapped up, buried, literally buried potential inside of you. And I want to help you pull it out and transform from a little, 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 little grasshopper, a little caterpillar into the blooming, beautiful butterfly and wild flower. Wild, wild. Be a person of, of love, be kind, be a person of integrity, 
do the right damn thing at all times. You cannot go wrong. I am telling you. Okay, it says you was you said I was on you was wrong. The best is yet to come. I can make it on my own. I don't need you. I found a strength I've never known. I ooh y'all, we ain't done yet. Ooh, this lady is no joke. She is no joke. It says um, I'll bring thunder. I'll be I'll bring rain. When I'm finished, they won't even know your name. Ooh, you don't know my name. So they won't even, nobody will know their name. But you'll be the one with the fame. I, it don't say that. I'm just saying that. Because that's my, what's, what, what my, my spirit is saying out of my mouth, out of, my, out of myself. Um, <clears throat> ain't nobody going to know their name because they put so much dirt on you and talked about you and tried to hurt you and ruin you. Because they saw something in you, short timers. They saw something in you that you don't even see in yourself. You have to discover yourself. You have to wake up. It's called self-authentication. You, to self-discovery, you learn who you are. Self-awakening. And that's why it says, be still and know that I am God. They said, we're the, we're the kingdom of heaven. What are you talking about this kingdom of heaven? What, what are you talking about? Seek first the kingdom of heaven. That means seek first yourself. Seek first the kingdom of heaven. Where is the king? They, that's the second question they said in the scriptures. They said, well, where is, where is this kingdom of heaven at? Well, 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 it's within you. Huh? What you mean? What you mean? The kingdom is within you. Seek it first. How you going to seek it? Go within you. Simple. Simple is as simple does. Come on now. It also says, um, it says, well, you were wrong. Now the message is going to go. When I'm finished, they won't even know your name. <laughs> I'm going to bring thunder and I'm going to bring rain. And when I'm finished, they ain't even going to know your name because it's going to be all about that's what they're saying. Okay, now, lastly right here, it says, you brought the flames and you put me through hell. I had to learn how to fight for myself. And we both know the truth, all the truth I could tell. I just say this. I wish you farewell. That's what it says. That's pretty much it, y'all. And then it goes and repeats itself on the chorus. That's it. The, 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 the song, the name of the song is Praying. And... It's by Kesha, K-E-S-H-A, okay? And I was going to say, um, wow, it's uh, 18 minutes into the video, but I wrote a song called Dream Big, and that's what I want y'all. I want to leave y'all with that. I'm just going to spit a little, a couple of uh, bars of it, and it goes, Dream Big, you can do it. Don't be scared. You can do it, achieve it. Success is here. Success, okay, I can't talk it. I got to sing it. Dream big, you can do it. Don't be scared. You can do it, achieve it. Success is here. The reckon, the definition is inside. Waiting to explode. Be happy now. Dream big. Be the next episode. Whatever you want, you can do it. Dream it. Get it done. Day by day, imagine that in your head. You done won. So imagine. Co-create with your creator. Go within. Find out who you are. Be quiet. Be still. It says, be still and know that I am God. That's what it say. Why not just do it? That's what it say. You ain't following no religion. You ain't following no rules. You following the he only left you basic instructions before leaving earth. And that is Holy Bible. And if you ain't following the Bible, I mean, I'm just saying, I'm not ever going to debate your position. On any belief system, on any religion. I just do not do that. Okay, we just don't do that. All right, y'all. That's it. Uh, 19 minutes on the clock, and we're going to 20 minutes, and that's it. I really want to say thank you for joining me, Shard Thomas. I thank you. We are approaching right now, actually, probably by the time I get off this video, 1,600 subscribers, 1,600. And we are climbing. And for that, I am so thankful and grateful. 
Man, that's all I do is say, I don't even get tired of saying thank you. Because I have too much to be thankful for. So you guys rewind this video, listen to those lyrics. Matter of fact, don't do that. Just go to YouTube, type in prayer or praying. Yeah, praying. That's the name of the song. It's been 20 minutes and I've been on, I've been on here long enough. I really appreciate each and every one of y'all. Thank you for sharing this video out there, for liking and subscribing. And then we're going to have these healing hands uh, minister, you, minister to you and and we're going to, I believe it. I believe in energetic healing. Yes, sir. That is who I am. I've been doing it since I was younger. 20, 30, 40, 50. Since in my 20s, 30, 40, 50, 30 something years. I just haven't been inactive with it and practicing it. But it's time. It's time to rise and shine. You can bet your bottom dollar. You got it in you. I'm waiting for you to do it. What, what you got to do? Start a YouTube channel. Write your goals down. Write your goals. So what you don't know how to do goals? Write your dreams down. Because once you write your dreams down, those become your goals. Do the damn thing, y'all. I love you so much. Bye, y'all. See ya.